Hi everyone, my name is Abhinav from Migration Centre of Australia. I want to talk a little bit about family violence in relation to the partner visa. If you've been subject to family violence while you're on your partner visa or you're onshore and have lodged an onshore partner visa application and have been subject to family violence, this means a person experiencing or fearing physical, sexual or psychological abuse and damage forced sexual relations or forced isolation or economic deprivation. So if any of these things have occurred to you, it means you've been subject to family violence. Now you don't need to stay in a relationship where you have been subject to it, even if you're worried about your visa. If we can demonstrate that you have been subject to family violence, then it may be possible for you to still get your permanent partner visa application. Now. How can you demonstrate family violence? This can either be judicially determined or non-judicially determined. Judicially determined evidence that family violence has occurred include a court injunction under the Family Law Act, an order issued by an Australian court, a conviction or finding against the alleged perpetrator in respect of their offence. Non-judicially determined examples are outlined in a legislative instrument called IMI 23-026 and you must provide at least two pieces of evidence from what's prescribed in this legislative instrument to demonstrate that you have experienced family violence. I recommend you look at this legislative instrument in your time to consider what are the best options for you and most people do use the non-judicially determined claims rather than go through a court or legal proceedings to demonstrate this. If you have any questions regarding this, you can always contact a professional, a migration agent or a lawyer that's familiar with this. Now, this family law or family violence provision applies to subclass 309 and you're already in Australia, subclass 820, so that's a temporary visa, dependent child visa as well, subclass 445, in relation to the partner visas. So if you have experienced family violence and you're on a temporary visa in Australia, you can still obtain permanent residency. If you have any questions regarding this, contact us at MCA.